What's up, everyone? How is everyone doing? How is everyone? Let me check my audio. Sorry for the double audio. Okay, it seems to be working good. Alright, if you haven't noticed, the camera is off. That is on purpose. Um, the reason why I'm doing that purposely for right now is because I just got home. I had to do some grocery shopping. <clears throat> and I w was able to get me some... Uh, what is this? Taco Bell. And I'm very self-conscious about how I eat. So... Hold on. Is my mic not picking? Oh, yeah, it is. Okay, okay, okay. Um, so I am going to have it turned off while I eat. Uh, so you may ha hear some smacking, too. Give me just a second. I gotta go get my sauce. Alright, so what are we doing today? Okay. What we're doing is... Um... I've rebuilt my Forsaken team. If you remember a couple of streams ago, I had a Forsaken team. And the Forsaken team... Um... Was my infinite team. Well, what happened was, one game... I was switching maps. I was switching maps and the game glitched out. And so I actually lost my community. It was on like day 68. Not very not very long, but it had a lot of uh, equipment and a lot of uh stuff already built up. So kind of a bummer. Well, for those who know this game, there is a soft cap. Do you think you can help find a missing person? And then there's a hard cap. Oh, uh, don't know. The soft cap is nine members. Once you get to nine members, you're not going to get any more easily. You have to have the builder leader in charge to get the 12 members. Now... You don't have to win with the builder, but you do got to get to the in, like the final mission for the uh, for their uh, what is it called legacy to then uh, get these extra people. But um, I did that, so we are we're on standard, and I am rebuilding my group. And it's actually better than what it used to be. So we're going to go through everyone. We have Programmer. Programmer allows you to use assault drones and allows you to craft remote box mines. It also has a negative 15% uh, on most radio cooldowns. Um, you'll see a lot of my people with weapon handling. The reason why I chose this is for the negative 25% durability loss per shot. That's actually really good. Um, I would like to change this. I'm gonna get books to change this. Uh, uh, change some of these guys' stats. Stealth, though. Stealth is very important. It's actually the basic skill. Reason why it's very important to me is you can actually sprint while crouch and you can Action. silently open locked doors and while crouch. Huge. Next? Next we get to work fixing up this town. I'm going to remove powerhouse for the basic uh, marathon. Marathon just allows you to sprint without uh, uh, 
any loss of stamina when you're lightly encumbered. So that's enough of these. Gun, uh, is this the one? Add aim snap costless. Yeah, Gunslinger is the best one because you can press A while aiming and snap onto a zombie's head. But I digress. We got our surgeon. Um, plus 20 to ma uh, health uh, for the community. Unlocks injury recovery action at infirmary. We have our munitions. Unlocks safe, uh, fire safe storage. Improves yield of ammo production at the workshop. Allows crafting of thermite, C4, and improve ammunition. Um, it also gives us plus 10 on max ammo storage. Engineering. Allows crafting of homemade scopes, cross scoped crossbows, and advanced muzzle attachments. Also, negative 33% uh, weapon repair uh, uh, parts cost. That's a screamer. This could get noisy. Pathogen um, unlocks uh, infection reduction actions at the infirmary. Infirmary um, produces more plague samples and reduce cost of plague cure. That's actually pretty nice. Plus 50 infection resistance to the community. And extracts more plague samples more often. And offers medical advice. I think our other guy offers that too. Sleep psychology. Plus two beds, plus four morale. That's actually pretty nice, even though we could go without. Technically, you can get by with just nine people. Twelve people you don't need because that's one of the guys that I use. This is the other person you can kind of go without, which is unlock auto shop, allowing crafting of vehicle auto or upgrade kits, which we don't have an auto shop at an auto shop and advanced tool kits at workshop three, which we do have. So we can get advanced tool kits, which will allow us to either trade them or just have them. But this is good. Especially for lethal, plus 25% fuel efficiency, community, plus 50% vehicle stealth, community. This is another person we don't necessarily need, but it's nice to have. Recycling, plus 2 materials per day, plus 25 parts per day. You use parts to repair your weapons, so that's huge. <clears throat> Pharma pharmaceutical, or I think that's what it says. Um... Allows crafting of strong painkillers, improves yields of med uh, meds produced at the infirmary, and further improves crafting of recovery items. Um, plus 10 to med storage. <clears throat> Nutritionist. Allows crafting of nutritional snack snacks to improve stamina bonus from a feast and reduce stamina penalty from rations. Um, plus 10 health, plus 10 stamina to community. Nutritional snacks not only give you stamina like regular snacks, but they also heal you over time for a bit. We've heard rumors of a few towns in eastern mm. Montana that never fell to the sets. Unlock uh, construction. We should all learn from these folks. Unlock heavy-duty uh, storage. Allow crafting of storage facility mods. And can make materials from parts. Plus one labor. We can also take parts or, or materials from the work or from the storage and make them into parts. So that's kind of we can make parts uh, into materials and we can make materials into parts. Agriculture. Unlock top end uh, gardens and farms upgrades for food production. Plus one food. And so that's our lineup of people. Now, I'm going to be honest. <clears throat> I need to eat. <laughs> um, for those who don't know, I have a bunch of health issues and blood sugar is one of them. And so I need to uh, eat.
so yeah don't worry I'll I'll be playing in between eating but I definitely need to eat something I didn't want to start the Got stream too the late city. which is why I went ahead and started it personal space around here like yesterday. Okay, I'll be there shortly. Listen, I won't forget what you did for me. If we don't quiet down, we're gonna get mobbed by Z's. Sorry guys, meeting. Sorry.
Go. I hear you. Why do all the people that end up in this place such weirdos? They either keep zombies as pets or whatever, or they, uh, or they, uh, eat humans. Like, I had a one group that was, uh, cannibals. I'd break open the sack just to throw away the meat and keep, like, the jewelry that we found. I'm gonna go back. My car is up there, but the outpost, our closest outpost is right here. I'm gonna get someone else. My characters get a little tired because there's two less beds. Because if you take the eight beds that the container for um, gives, right? And you add the two that we get from the uh, psychologist, um, that's 10 beds and we have 12 members. So that is going to be a diff uh, pretty difficult uh, thing right there. So let's see. Right now what I'm working on is trying to get everybody to, to hero level. So we can get those extra bonuses because those extra bonuses can help out the community a lot even if uh, they only help out the individual um but like a lot of them are increasing morale which at standard is not necessarily needed but when you have that permanent morale debuff at the higher levels, it really does help. I think um, I'm gonna go get my vehicle.
I wish <clears throat> the gas button wasn't the trigger. Or at least the stick to turn the vehicle wasn't on the opposite side of the gas trigger. Kind of requires you to have two hands. I haven't eaten all day, to be honest. Which is kind of my fault, but... I knew my mom was coming to get me to go grocery shopping, so I was like, you know, I'm gonna wait for her. I didn't know it was gonna be so late, though. But, you know, can't really complain when you're getting help. Anybody home? Take point? I'll follow. Sure. You have acquitted yourselves well. You're welcome. And thanks for the compliment. Let's go. <laughs> Didn't mean to hit that. I meant to turn on the lights. But yeah. I wanna give a shout out to all my YouTube uh, subscribers. I got a couple of new ones. I really do appreciate you guys. Um, for those who also answered the poll, thank you so much. Um, for those who don't know, I have a poll up asking, uh, would you like to see more survival games or more FPS games? Now, I'm going to play other games like RPGs and other types of games, but... Right now, I'm really into State of Decay, but me and Johto are also getting back into Apex, so I'm just gauging what people want to see the most. Um, cause then I'll make more of an effort to uh, play those games and upload them. Also, 98% um, of you uh, are not uh, subscribed on YouTube. I'd really appreciate it if you go on and like the content to uh, subscribe. I know I sometimes have uh, audio we issues. We need to speed up. It's okay. You're safe now. And well, I'm with in your mic bed. issues, and I apologize no for that. Um, uh, unfortunately, I am not in the best of. Uh, financial state but I am a full-time uh, I am a full-time streamer um I know on YouTube my YouTube bio isn't as in-depth as my Twitch bio that's mainly because YouTube is just where I post my my past streams and uh, have like a stream archive for those who get into my channel and want to go back and watch uh, some of my earlier videos and hell I'm, I may once I'm able to get a video editor because I, I don't think I'm going to be able to learn uh, video editing not at the quality as someone who does it for a living um, I may even do some like reactions to my old video and we can cringe together <laughs> because the more I do it the better I'm gonna get at it of course that's how everyone is with anything um so it'll be nice to see the difference and of course uh, I hope to improve upon the quality of my streams um but yeah, uh, he really did me dirty on these tacos. But, shout out to everyone on YouTube. I really appreciate it. And I hope you continue to support me. Um, 
I've noticed that more people watch my uh, YouTube channel, and I, that really excites me. It really makes me happy. Um, hopefully, like I said, I can continue to provide y'all with some good content, and I hope one day, uh, or I hope soon, my Twitch channel can explode again. And, Hopefully, have some more uh, I'm not gonna live lie. viewers. We have a truckload of zombies coming in. Because Man could get I love interacting with you guys. Also, YouTube, I am going to try to use the community tab a little bit more on YouTube to communicate with you guys. But for everyone, this is uh, just as much for you guys as it is for me. But I do have a Discord. Uh, and the links are both on Twitch and YouTube. The if you want to connect with other people that like the same content, um, then go check out my we Discord. I won't lie, it's not very active right now, but that's because I don't have a, a big enough following for it to be. So be some of the first people to be able to utilize and interact with me on Discord. I would love to see it more active. I'm gonna make sure, you no, know, like these guys. The, uh, ooh. Oh, well, that didn't take long. New Z-Wave incoming. Okay, we're gonna go back to this guy. This way he can get the 200. Right? We're gonna go back up here and make sure we know. Make sure no uh freak get in. We're on freak control. The weaker zombies, everyone else can take out. Yeah. No problem. Hold them back, damn it! We barely got through this. Imagine how much worse it is for the people out there alone. Okay, oh my. He's almost there. Uh... And then we'll move to this one. To this one. Let's see. And that's it. Noise. Love Lily. Also, if you like my content, especially on the FPS side or first person shooter side, definitely go check out Lily Mario. Love her to death. She's uh she's so awesome. Um also uh, uh check out the channels that I suggest at the bottom. Some of them, well, not some of them, all of them are channels that I really like and enjoy and watch myself. Unfortunately, I do not have any connection with them at all. But Mousy is, or Iron Mouse is one of the channels that got me into streaming because I, I didn't think of myself as very good looking or very funny or you know I have a bunch of health problems too not as bad as her on the like like physical health maybe on the mental side because I do struggle a lot with mental disabilities I, I'm on medication 
I have a therapist, things like that. <clears throat> but, um, so the way she fights and works hard made me give it a try. I like Connor. Sometimes I want to beat him up, especially when he sips his tea into the mic. That is so annoying. <laughs> I want to I wanna fight him for that. <laughs> <laughs> but I like I like uh, the monkey, as he is called. Um, Saikuno's not on Twitch anymore. He's on YouTube. But I love Saikuno. He's so uh, I like him because I, he's what I want to be. I want to be a guy that can be like. I don't know. So nice, but evil at the same time. As he is. <laughs> um. Who else do I have? I'm, I'm trying to think. Uh, Phoenix PC. That is a company that um sponsors me. If you're looking for a new PC, I do have a uh a code that you can use. Um, link is on my Twitch bio. I think it's also on my Twitter. Um, I don't know if it's on Discord. I know it's not on YouTube. But if you use that link, um, and you'll get, I think, 5% off or something like that on your next computer. And they have different models and stuff like that, but they sponsor me. Um... But they also build your PC on stream. So definitely go check out them. And then you have... Uh... I'm trying to think of her name. I know it. I, I have her face and voice in my head. But I can't remember her name. Oh my gosh, this is going to bother me. I gotta look. Screw it, I'll just look at my channel. Why can I remember the people I have on my channel? That makes no sense. Oh no, because I'm live, I can't see my channel. No! Fine, I know, I know what I'm doing. Emeru. There you go, Emeru. <coughs> I'm gonna be honest. Emeru is just cute. I think she's fucking cute. That's, that's the only reason why I'm so stupid. But those are the people I try to uh, promote myself. Because I like their content. And that's it. I just like their content. Man, they're cool people. We eat this last taco and then we'll get in. Oh no.
Alright. <clears throat> I'm done. So, going back to what I was saying, what we're doing. Um, I'm going to plug in my, my camera back in. The reason why we are preparing um, to go to a higher, a higher rank or to lethal is because when we get there, oh, it's on. It's going to be very difficult. That's pretty heavy. The the map is not going to have a lot of resources. So, what you can do is you can gather a lot of resources um at a lower level and then put it to a higher level. Now, the other reason why I started on standard is because I didn't have all my people. And we got three new people because of what I said earlier about the uh, soft cap and the hard cap. <clears throat> so we had to level those characters up. Never want to have a, a character who... You never want to level a character up in a, in a high level because the chances of them dying are very high. Even for a maxed character... Um, it would be pretty difficult, but when you're bringing a community in to a, to a lethal game and they already Drop have, some goodies. Hope it helps. they already have supplies, they already have vehicles that are upgraded, they already are max skill maxed everything and you get to pick what uh particular facility they start off in you significantly you. increase your chances of survival matter of fact since we're already here we have the van Go, uh, Damn, it's locked. Okay. Where are we playing as? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh. I don't... Back out, yeah. Punk. Okay, there we go. Okay, we're playing as Kenny. Why isn't it not letting me scroll through my people? It's quiet. Oh, flip is up. Okay, whatever. I just wanted to look at my people and move to the person who I'm playing as and see how much influence they still need to get. Like but whatever. This game is jank sometimes. I hate that because I really love it, this but bro. Why, why, why do games have so many glitches in them? Good games. Not going far with all this. So, <clears throat> what's the plan? The plan is to loot this entire map, get every single resource, take our time, because we're going to need at least 5,300 influence to be able to pick, like, any base that we want for the next, uh, and if I can come back to this map, I'm just gonna pick the uh, the container fort because this community was built in the container fort. 
so I know what we're gonna have and what we're not gonna have. And everything that I want is in this in this space. So let me show you what I mean by everything I want. Alright. So Everything I want in a base. I want the fighting and shooting range. When fully maxed out, it gives you stamina, plus 20 stamina, plus 20 health. That's huge. Let's be honest, that's huge. 20% more, or 20 points more. That, that's, that's big. I get the farming three, get a kitchen two. The other big thing is the stillery. I can use this to make um, ethanol, which allows me to make medicine. I can then turn ethanol into uh, uh, homemade whiskey and brandy. Or is that brandy? Bron. Brondon? I don't know. Uh, uh, craft beer and barley wine. This stuff can all be traded. Which the trade depot allows me to trade or call a trader to my facility and allows me to get a number of other things an infirmary three, a workshop three, fire safe, and a command center. But not only that, the way I have my outpost set up, no matter where I am on the map, there's an outpost within a reasonable distance. I need to find the mod that allows us to have two outposts. I only have the one that gives us one. Um, and the reason why is there's a facility right up here that I want. Um, right there. And it is an artillery base. So, to go through all my what the hell outposts, am I thinking? we have a gun shop, a clinic, food, and gas. This is why, again, I don't know why the community persons tab is, like, glitched out right now. It's not because I'm not in the base, but... I'm not... Why is it not letting me... Okay, there we go. Um, that's why we have this dude. Because he gives us materials. So think about it. I'm sorry. Ammo, I can't. health, food, gas. Food's at the top, meds, ammo. No materials, but that guy produces uh, two materials. The workshop produces one. And then fuel, and then he also produces parts. Trade Depot produces influence. So we have positive everything. Positive food. Which I can tell right now, one of these is out. Positive food. Positive meds by one. Positive ammo. Positive materials, gas, and parts, and influence. We can, the thing is, you can take one and trade for the other. So I could take my excess gas and trade for more materials. Take my excess materials and trade for ammo. You know, so, stuff like that. And then this is, could. facility covers all of our, our materials anyway. Which we have the fighting gym, the shooting range, the farm, trade depot, infirmary, steel two, kitchen two. That's seven right there. And it covers it all. Um, and then to have that artillery up here, mortar strike, that's huge because then we can um, be able to... I'm gonna go back to him because he's almost 
almost maxed out. Going back, uh, you know, getting that mortar strike, that's, that's, that allows us to clear infestations or knock out hordes or help us with a juggernaut. You know, it's so, there's so much to it. Um, we need food. I might get rid of some of my other sack. Sacks. Hello. I'm here with food for trade. I don't remember taking someone's grenade launcher off of them and not putting it back, so... Also, guys, uh, like I said before, if anybody wants to trade rucksacks for books, I'm down for that. Or, or mods. That's pretty heavy. I need a couple of mods. Got anything useful you're looking to unload? All right. I'm gonna go ahead and just, I'm gonna go ahead and buy this. Cause to make it, Drop we need successful. food and we need, we need, uh, need food. I've been making these out of the excess material. I'm gonna see how much I get from it. Got anything useful you're looking to unload? Okay, we're getting 34. Okay, but let's see this. Um, rucksack materials. What do you say to a bit of bartering? Sure, sounds 60. good. But for how much? I barely lift this. I think it was three, right? How much is one of those mods that I built? How much do they take? They take three, so... We get more influence if we just trade it outright than make something from it. Which kind of doesn't make sense to me. Shouldn't it be the other way around? Because... We're taking uh, material and turning it into a finished product. Shouldn't that uh, give us more resources? Or, I mean, more influence? But it is what it is. You gotta drop something else first. Okay, let's do this. Of course. Okay, let's do this. That's a lot of crap to haul around. Wow, let's do this, bruh. Risky. Let's do this, bruh. Bruh. You turn me, bruh. I'm sorry, I'm stupid. <laughs> Not possible. Brewski. Let's do this, broski! That's a lot of shit. Okay, I need to I need to look at something too. Okay. So fucking juggernauts. Okay, so three food, so a sack, right? A rucksack, which is 175 influence to make five jugs. Watch of out ethanol. for that feral. Then I could take. Five jugs and ethanol and turn it into whiskey, three bottles of whiskey.
Okay, I'm uh... Three bottles of uh, whiskey and one bottle of that. Right? How much is that? Influence wise. I got a feeling you and me can do business. Sure, sounds good. 204. Plus 34. So we're looking at 238. So the F. So one sack of food, which is only three, 100. Strength which costs is how you 100. Gain security, so. but wisdom is how you keep it. Okay, so that is a profit. Survive, you need teachers. So eight minus five, that's three. Three. One hundred and thirty-three uh, uh, influence profit right there. Now. It's three food for a four six pack and one yeah, hardly it. one. So let's see how that's a lot of crap to haul around. Hey, you. Be seeing you. So, you ready to start dealing? Of course. Okay. So that's a uh, two hundred and four, three hundred and six for that. For one seventy. Now, question is though, because okay, craft beer is actually. I think way more way more um I got a feeling you and me can do profitable than using the uh, or making the whiskey. So the question is though how much would we lose at the higher level? What I mean is, rucksacks are gonna probably cost more influence at lethal. I'm at your base. With that ammo you wanted to trade for? And, uh, at the same time, we'll probably get less per package. So... Why are you all the way out here? I got something you want, you got something I want. All right. I have all of these. That shit's gonna slow me down. So, you ready to start dealing? Of course. And here's the other thing. When, uh... We want to get... As close as we can to all our uh, to all our caps I got a feeling you and me can caps. do business sure sounds good um before we go over to the lethal so what I want to do is get uh our fuel is good 
our materials are good. Ammo needs to get up to about 70, 75. Uh, meds need to get up to 58 or whatever, and then 48 for food. That's the... That's what I would like. Ammo, we definitely need more ammo. So I'm gonna, I know, I'm gonna go ahead and buy more from her. I know we don't I got a feeling have... you and me can do business. Of course. We don't have much more to trade. Would like to stay above 6,000 though. But we're not gonna leave until all my guys are heroes and also all of uh let me make you an well, offer the majority sure. of the map is uh looted okay we're at 52 all right Mark the thing instead of the creature. Okay. But Careful! Don't breathe any of that. Man, the gate was like killing me there. This place looks safe for now. Place looks safe to now. Now, here, here's another thing. Because we do not have a lot of storage. Good thing I got low expectations. I mean, okay. How how should I phrase this? There's a way to get more resources to come with you than what you have in storage. Uh, and the way you do that is, I, uh, when you go to switch maps, it will say that all your vehicles in the rucksacks in them will come with you. So, the van normally has the most, uh, resource slots. If you upgrade the van, no matter what type of van it is, it becomes a four-door van, and it gets nine slots. Um, which is the largest capacity of any vehicle. And... You can... Bring... All those resources with you. And so you can bring extra. So even though um, I do have a lot of materials, I'm going to keep collecting them. And the reason why is I can bring them with me. Pretty damn sure I smell some loot in this dump. And even if, uh, let's say we don't need materials, we can break it down for parts. Which, uh, again... You're gonna be using a lot of parts because that's how you repair your weapons and our uh, uh, your weapons and your melee weapons, which uh, cost more at the higher level as well.
Now, I got a lot done since the last time I streamed this uh, game. I, I did a lot off uh, stream. I'm probably going to do a lot more off stream. Yeah, no room for that. Um, Because a lot of it is just going to be me sneaking around looting places. Trying to get as much of the resources in this map that I can before moving on to uh, before moving on to lethal <coughs> I just want to make sure I was heading in the right direction. Loader alert! Oh, it's 88 meters away. I can only see something within 70. Oh, there it is. It's way up there. some pros and cons. weapons that I don't use or any uh, like ranged weapons that I don't use I break down so like that you I think you can have I can't remember but I think you can only have up to 9,999 parts. Don't quote me on that. Uh, you may be able to go higher. And that's just where the counter stops. Or you won't be able to. I'm not sure. wondering why I would jump over those two walls it's so I could stay inside that circle longer because when you clear a building a circle starts up around it and that building is considered or deemed safe meaning that you won't have to deal with uh, any zombies because they won't spawn within that area Jump that fence. Go ahead. Jump that fence. 
Pokemon be smart. He's like, oh hell no. Nah. You jumping that friend uh, fence? You saw what happened to Fred. I'm staying right here. And see these squares? These squares are what you gotta hit. Which basically means you gotta check every room, and if you check every room, then, um, you can then clear the building. And once the building's, uh, uh, clear. Now on lethal, I won't be able to do a lot of the stuff that I can do on this particular mode. It won't be too much different. I just gotta be now. really careful because on lethal, it's basically uh, if you get caught off guard. On this dump. Um. Kinda, you're kind of kind of screwed <laughs> you'll die that's a lot of shit Like, for example, I won't be able to run like I am now on lethal because there'll be a lot more zombies. Um, and they'll be a lot more difficult to, to defeat. Those two zombies right there would have attacked me, and that one too, on lethal, because the the sounds are a lot louder, and zombies are more like uh, aggressive. I I can't wait. It's gonna be a challenge, but I'm looking forward to that challenge, because I did start uh -oh. a game. I did start a game, a brand new game, so I'm talking uh, characters that aren't uh, uh, maxed out, it was only three of them, nah, I'm talking baby-faced community members, um, going into a lethal game, nah, this one? We're not going to be baby-faced. We're going to be veteran survivors. We're going to have a community. Everyone's going to have a job, a community job, like skill. Like, it's going to be totally different. The first game, I'm going to have to kind of speed run. And here's the reason why. Um... Take this one, for example. Hit the showers. Plus three morale. Requires water. <laughs> Why can't I scroll this down? Okay, whatever. Um, crops, vegetables require water. 
Irriga uh, irrigation rig boosts uh, pr production water and requires water. So there's a lot of buildings that require water, require solar array. Solar water heating. Oh. We're making it way too easy for the zombies to hear us in here. This requires water, but I can also produce water from this facility. So that is going to cover a lot of the issues we are going to have. Water, 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 water. Oops. Does any of my people require electricity? Hold on, what did that say? Oh, this needs power to give us one plus one materials. Not possible. But yeah. Okay, how much do we have left? Ooh, they, sh they are just getting stored in. But, if that's the only two, yeah. How's infestations? There's four over here, and then there's one over there. You know what? I'm just gonna take the van. Loader here. Oops. I'm just gonna take the van, go to the gas station, and loot around over there. It's something. Fuck it, empty. Dead free zone here. There was no glass there. The hell? That's why I jumped there. There was no glass there.
I love when I jump to the glass, you know, two zombies come running. This guy jumps through the glass, and this zombie's, like, literally just walking away, like, oh, no big deal. Like, how do they know the well, difference? Nothing in here worth a damn. Um, between, uh, me jumping through the glass and their zombie doohickey friends jumping through the glass. You know what I mean? How do they know the difference? They don't know the difference. How dare they act like they know the difference? Better keep my eyes peeled. saying like they should not know or they should uh yeah they shouldn't know the difference any noise should be investigated that's a lot of crap to haul around yep a pretty large amount of crap. Nice. Almost looted this whole place. Um. Let's see. Still. No, we already looted that place. We still have three more places, but almost already have a van full. Mm. I'll keep the firecracker for now, but that's something that we could easily drop because we can craft them although you know I don't really like dropping stuff if I'm gonna get rid of stuff I'd rather trade it and get at least a small amount of influence to be honest to be honest I want that influence because um I can then take that influence and pretty much mm, turn it into anything. Uh, let's just go to the coffee shop across the thing. And then next time I'll come up here. The van. I thought I looted that place. I guess not. You don't see me. Don't act like you see me. Sounds like a ward somewhere. Oh no, he's by himself. Okay, that place is done. Good day. Okay, um... I guess I'll just go back to base and then head over to that one area I love when the doors are off I know that sounds silly because you ha I technically have less protection But I really like it when the doors are off. There's one there too. Man, there's a lot of um, 
ferals around. Okay, we don't need to turn those in. I think I'm gonna need to upgrade this van next, the passenger van. How much gas do we have? We have plenty. Going to this house next. And then we'll almost have all of this city up. the fat boy. Okay. Okay, let's take this one out first. Can't do it. What? <laughs> Oh, freaking post. First one I did miss. But the second one was on. Wooden post got in the way. I hate when he runs because it makes it so much harder to hit. Yep, he saw me. for him next go ahead and eliminate all the threats around this particular household so that we can loot in peace peace and quiet let me know I didn't know we had a traitor. Fuck, he stopped walking. Ah! Okay, that one I did miss. I won't lie. If I shoot him in the butt, it ain't gonna do nothing. You gotta shoot him in the head. He dies in one hit. In the head. I'm gonna have to get closer. <laughs> no, turn I'm this to way. Getting walked like a dog. He's like, walk me, master. Walk me. Oh, now you stop. Oh, you little shit. Up, oh, you saw me. Sneak up on him and kill him. <laughs> All right. 
Let's loot the barn first. Hold on. All that work for this? What do you mean all that work for this? Good stuff right there. What's the other one? <clears throat> when me and Jetto are not uh, practicing for the next season of Apex, I'll be playing. Um, Either State of Decay or Overwatch. Like I said before, I'm really back into State of Decay. Especially because of that, the fact that I can take my whole community into another map. I don't know when they did that update. Uh, I was gone for a long time. I played it like non-stop the, the first few months that it came out. But then I kind of stopped playing it. Now I'm challenging myself. I want to get... I want to get every legacy unlocked on lethal. And this is the community I'm going to do it with. But... I had to put this community together... So I started it on standard. Not bad. Once I've looted this entire map, or maybe not the entire map, is it, once I get everyone standing to hero. Yeah, no room for that. Um, and then also, uh, yeah, I think just the and all their stats maxed out, which most of them are. That's when I am going to change the difficulty to, uh... This is Twain. Telling you that the problem is, we're fighting zombies like the people. Zombies are a disease. So make like penicillin, people. What the hell does that mean? This load's gonna wear me out. Ooh, we just got an extra one. That means we could trade that. It's gonna be a good trading item. That's gonna fetch a, a good price. And good uh, amounts of influence. Guess that's it for this place. Sweet. We, uh... No more dead fuckers here. We got... We looted the, um... Whole house and the whole barn. So now all we got is this building over here, this uh, house over here, and I think we'll have everything looted in this first city. We looted a lot over here too. And we looted a lot in here. So that means realistically just this area along this road and in this area and uh we'll pretty much have everything looted or, or the a majority of the stuff looted not all Sorry, I didn't mean to run you over. I love honking the horn at juggernauts as I go by, because I feel like if I was a juggernaut, that would just piss me off. Oh, you son of a... <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, well. I can make. Ooh. Mace. 
gives me an idea. Hey, did you miss me? Hey, no, I didn't. So this is what feeling happy is like. Cold and food, uh, so med. And then what we'll do is. Someone just got here looking to trade. Interested? If you're still looking for meds, I'm your guy. Oh, uh, for real? For my guy? Come on, my guy. Oh. Who am I playing as? We've got you? a good thing going here with this team we're building. There sure are a lot of creeps coming this way. Get home quick, folks. I like how the sleep psychologist is tired. <laughs> <laughs> so what what did you do before the outbreak oh it's a sleep psychologist oh wow so you get a lot of good sleep no <laughs> i'm freaking okay. exhausted on top of our base right now. yep i see him freak has approached our base Waiting for more to show up is definitely the hardest part. I'll take out all the freaky freaks. Oh my gosh, bro. I hate that. And I lead. In this game, there is no such thing as leading your shots. It's, uh, it's more, uh, you need to aim directly at them. And it throws me off sometimes. Because I'll lead Bad my news. shots. We got a freak here. Bastards, hell, bros! Hell, bros. Yo, bros. What's up, bros? See, like that? The first shot was lead, and then the Back. <laughs> that, that is fun. <laughs> I wish that was like a thing. You could bite them back. <laughs> Where did this guy go? Oh, I got a feeling you and me can do business. Oh, that sounds about right. Feel like me and you can do this. Okay. All right. Who wants to bite a zombie? Cause I sure do. It's gonna slow me down. Well, ain't that too bad? Okay, let's do this. Sounds good. What? I only get 85 for this? Okay. Okay, it's the handgun, but still 85 for that? like I should get a little bit more I don't know what do you guys think I think I should have got at least like a hundred saying oh my god 
of sand. Like so, so you ready to start booty. dealing? Sounds like a plan. Some booty patootie. Maybe a little fruity. Hola friends. Hola. What's up? Holy cow. So many zo zombie freaks around. So many freaks. At Jodo's house. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> too many freaks. Oh my gosh. What? Oh, I killed him. Hold on. Why did it give me the experience? Uh, not, uh, not experience, the, uh... Why didn't it give me the, uh, whatchamacallit for it? The, um, influence. That's some bull. That really is some bull. Don't need the juggernaut alone. If he gets close to the base, then everybody in the base will shit on him. Can't see over that hill. Oh, booty. I was trying to shoot him through the butt. D okay. I think if I shoot him in the butt, it should go to his head. Uh, I didn't want to wait. <laughs> I didn't want to wait. See, this is perfect if I had the artillery. I could be like, yo. Punk. Yeah, look at him. He's scared. He's walking away. I scared him away. Shot him in. He was like, nah, bro. I don't want this heat. I don't want this smoke. I'm like, yeah, you don't want it. <laughs> Take your cornbread. Your cornbread would be mine. Your cornbread. Wrong door. <laughs> Fantastic. Fantastic. All right, I'm gonna switch characters because this one is and I'm out of gas. getting really tired. ammo for now um you are the last one that needs to become a hero i need a hero i need a hero oh did they kill the juggernaut let's go see yep i told you if he gets close to this base he's done for bag him. Yeah, how you like that, zombie? Bastard. Alright. Where are we going next? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I'm just gonna run there. Um, the way I have my AI set up is... Okay, background story time. I said this before. And I might elaborate on it more. Um, okay. So the Forsaken 
is a mercenary group. And this mercenary group before the uh uh before the this uh outbreak, the zombie outbreak, the apocalypse, um did humanit humanitarian aid and also fought in different conflicts. Most of them are from, you know, the uh, United States uh, Special Forces. That's, that's my community's background. That's why they all wear tactical suits and military helmets. That's why they all are equipped with... Uh, very uh, um, standardized weapons, but that are also special in a sense because, like, for example, this rifle right here 100 round magazine, one in the chamber. So, uh, either an advanced or professional um, suppressor. And then for secondary, they all have secondaries MAC 10, a 45 caliber, 30 round. Uh, uh, capacity um, so the background story is the Forsaken is a um, mercenary group so the way I have my people set up is six of them have the nine millimeter as their secondary uh, 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 guns, right? And then six of them have a 45 caliber uh, secondary weapon. So, realistically, for sidearm side arm ammo, we only have to worry about the 9mm and the 45 caliber. For primary weapons, um, they have the 5.56 round and the 7.75 round. Um, and also two shotguns and two internally suppressed 50 cal rifles. The, t the two, um, internally suppressed 50 cal rifles have a four round magazine. And... They are able to take down a juggernaut with one clip if they shoot the head with all four rounds. I think it's five or six if it's in the body. Maybe even more because they're really tanky in the body. So that's what those 50 cals are for, taking out the juggernauts. Um, the two shotguns, there's one with a model... 1800 or something like that that gun has a lot of range even though it's a shotgun and then the other one has the AA-12 which is the automatic uh, shotgun and it has a high rate of fire but is very close range and then so that's four people with special special dairy uh a weaponry and then there's eight people with basically assault rifles the 5.56 and the five or the 7.75 round and so that's how I have my people set up so when we when our base gets attacked normal zombies like the regular doohickeys these guys right here they're not going to be an issue. Also, every single one of my people uses a bladed weapon. The reason why is a bladed weapon can kill a zombie standing up um, by cutting their head off. While a blunt weapon, you have to hit them down on the ground most of the time. Because, you know, a blunted weapon has a lot of uh, kick knockback. Um, and so you have to knock them down on the ground and then you have to kill them that way 
where a blade, you just gotta hit them like three or four times and then they die. If you have sword, uh, the specialty sword master or whatever, you can uh, literally um, execute them standing up, which is OP as crap. So, there's that. Um, we got a screamer. So, can you crouch, please? Okay, there you go. So, there's that. And what that does is, since I know what ammo that my people need, I can focus on that type of ammo and not a whole bunch of different types. I can also trade the other ammo that I don't use to purchase more yeah, ammo rucksacks sure to then make Hey there. Let's just take a look see. Sure, sounds good. What is that? A small but functional bake oven sold in mine to gain the ability to use a little food for a long morale boost. Huh. Is is that, <clears throat> is that worth it? Maybe not. What are you doing here? I don't know what they're doing here. I'm gonna be... I'm, I, I'm excited to... To go to lethal, but at the same time, I'm very nervous because I really don't want to lose anyone. Because this is like my, this is like my favorite community. Been over this place top to bottom. Okay. Another, uh, got another, uh, med, uh, sack. We'll definitely have to come back Guess and pick what? that up. Something's come up. I don't know, is that a fat boy? We definitely want her to get to Hero because... Well, uh, she increases the in amount of influence that we gain by 15%, which is actually sounds low, but bro, it's it, it stacks up so much. Where are you going? I'm going on a trip in my favorite rocket ship. Oh, I got scared. I so shit the bed right there. I got scared after missing that first shot. I thought he was gonna run at me, so I started shooting like faster or and this totally lost my aim. I could have definitely killed him in one shot. That was garbage. Bro, don't come at me. You don't want this smoke. You don't you don't want to you don't want oh, 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 yeah. Do you? Yeah, yeah. Told you, you didn't want this, and you didn't listen. Now his head's gone. Shh! I'm hiding for rabbits. Turn around. 
turn around so I can shoot you. God, I hate when he runs around like that. Makes it so hard. Ooh. Take a seat. Take a seat, my friend. Mm, I feel like an an, an Indian uh, business rat man right now. This new stuff's for sharing. Comes in and says, "Take a seat. Take a seat, my friend. Take a seat." Just dirtied him. Dirtied all over him. Uh, I want. Don't um, think that's gonna happen. I need um. I need more food resources so I can uh. Need more food resources so I can make more um beer. Someone did a job clearing this place out. <laughs> that beer boy. Go back and get this sack of uh, potatoes. <laughs> Again, what are you doing here by yourself? Did you have like a fight with your team or something? Okay, whatever. Don't die. Don't uh, die. <laughs> Goodbye. I gotta rest. You gotta do something. With the head. Alright. <clears throat> I wanted to get all my guys to hero before I go to lethal, but if I get my um if I get all my community resources to max, I might just go ahead and do it. I would like to get to lethal this stream that way next stream it can be all lethal I wonder what that do I have anything to trade just this and I this. might be carrying too much here oh for real oh and this All right, might need some gas. <laughs> After I find where she is, I may loot that area. You know, do a little looting up there so I can, uh,
so I can get a, uh, let's see. Let me check my audio. Okay. Sorry for the double audio. I wanted to make sure, because you know, I was having mic issues earlier. So I'm, I'm thinking about looting all of this area. I don't think she's going to be up here. I bet you she probably is. If she isn't, I'm gonna be sad. I don't think she hey, is. Hey, anyone in here? Nope. They're not here. Where next? That was such a debate. Debated me. Well, we can definitely hey, see it's anyone not in there. here. All righty, where to look now? Remember, yeah. we're looking for the mod that. Okay. This is what my guys have the internally suppressed uh, uh, 50 cal. Why don't they have advance? Oh yeah, that's what I needed. These two. Ooh, that's so expensive though. Three thousand seven would drop it down to four. Four, and if I did um, that, it would just be four thousand straight up. Should I do that? Nah, we'll just keep everyone's well, that's stuff pretty the heavy. same. But I, I do want this so I can make another one of my vans, um, full like fully upgraded. And now I'm gonna just loot around. And after I loot, if I don't want anything, like it's nothing like really, really good, then I'm gonna just trade it to her to try to get some of my influence up, back. Like we want those chemicals because they can go into making ammo. We can make meds from chemicals. There's so much we could do with chemicals. Yeah. We could sure use this. That is not a good gun. I will sell that. See, I would just break this Let's down into materials, sure. but we're right here. So we're going to sell it. Now, the reason why I'm not going to buy those uh, books is because, realistically, if we go to the next, if we go to Lethal, we're not going to, we're not going to be able to have people who need to level back up. You know what I mean? So, I'm thinking ahead on that point. Like, 
Let's not, um... That's gonna slow me down. Let's not, uh... What was I gonna say? I'm so stupid. I'm trying to find where this place was. Is it in here? Where? Did I get everything? Uh, I don't know. Um, we just don't wanna. Okay, I've seen what there is to see. No, there is one more container, right? The ammo container. Oh, it's in here. Oh, I did get everything. Okay. All right. Yeah, we want all that stuff. It's a camp right here, but I'm pretty sure the shed is gonna be closer. can't carry that much um for those couple of people who were lurking um thank you i really appreciate it i might be carrying too much here We're not gonna get a lot of this stuff because we just don't have the room. But looks like they're cleared out. We're gonna we're gonna have a, a, at least a dent in it, right? We're not coming back empty-handed. If only I had room for it. Someone did a job clearing this place out. Huh, it was you. Okay, I'm gonna sell the bullets to her. Well, that's pretty heavy. Nice. Looks empty now, but that won't last. I'm almost. I might go ahead and leave after this. We got this house. The Feral, the two... eyes open. <laughs> and the two barns, right? Even if I sell this ammo, we're only gonna have one slot left. So it's like let's just take a look see why not There's no point in uh Staying here with the van full my inventory full Hold on maybe maybe we can make some room here Okay, we got two slots.
Ooh. Two. Well, uh, I believe there's room in the van for the the chemicals, and then I could. Tr that's a trading item, so we can trade that, and then we're gonna get two more slots, which means we'll we may be able to get yeah, almost everything from that. Oh no, they're both trade items. Okay. Okay. Got anything good? Why not? Got anything good? Okay. I don't know how much I spent. What did I buy? I bought 500. Okay. I bought that um thing for 500. I don't think I got all my money back, but You guys are gonna love the crap I just dropped off. We'll sell that. That will be some influence. I may even sell the, uh crossbow bolts because we do have some at home and we can make some and if I can clear out this house too that would be huge because then we'll have two like garage slash whatever's uh... got anything good sure only 11 though bruh Bruh. For real? Bruh. Bruh. Is that a jug? That is a jug. <laughs> Actually, this is the last thing we need to loot. We've got all there is to get here. Okay, we'll sell that too. We'll keep the snacks. So we got this, uh, these four houses right here completely looted. Let's just take a look. -see. Why not?
Okay, I'm gonna... I'm gonna put this one... This is the upgraded van. Oops. Nine slots, four doors. No matter what kind of... No matter what kind of upgrade. I think I'm going to end the stream today, or today, right now, I'm, I don't know what I'm saying. I think I'm going to end it right here. Um, I would like to get one more van that's upgraded like this, um, and have uh, three of them. Uh, like I said, we need to come up here and loot all this. And maybe come down here and loot this. But for the most part. We've looted quite a bit of the map. Not all of it, but quite a bit of it. And. Our goods are slowly growing. Each day. Alright guys, I'm gonna get in here. We'll have to get rid of some of our resources unless I'm we get, get out. storage. Deuces.